Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the vlog. It's a very early morning today. We're heading towards Huntington Beach for their annual Cars and Copters. Um, everybody, there's a lot of people already down there. A lot of supercars, a lot of hypercars are already there. And the event doesn't start till 10. Now look at this truck in front of me. It's crabbing so bad. Watch when it goes around the corner. It's like, it goes sideways almost. <laughs> looks like it's going sideways but yeah we already picked up our breakfast um, we're about an hour or about an hour out tops um, the main thing I'm concerned about is trying to find parking because I know that entire parking lot in front of the hotels and everything is for the entire event so hopefully we don't have to park too far to be able to see and there's shit all over in the road whoa whoa that's a ladder Okay, that fucking accord. Oh my god, that is a whole ass ladder in the middle of the road. I hope that got caught on camera. That that accord almost took it out. Wow. Okay, definitely an interesting start to the morning. So we're an hour out from Huntington Beach. Um, there's going to be a lot of cool stuff. It's a beautiful morning. It's very cold up here. It was 47 when I left my house, and now it's 53. And I'm wearing shorts and a t-shirt. <laughs> Hopefully it warms up, but uh, yeah. So we're on our way down. Can't wait to see what's on there. I wanna say 18 minutes away. And look what we got right here. Ooh, yeah. 55 Chevy, very nice. We got another one right next to me, here it is. Another 55 in green. Very nice. I'm assuming they're on the way to Cars and Copters. <laughs> All right. Well, we just parked up the car. Finally here in beautiful Huntington Beach, California. And as you can see way off in the distance, I don't know if you can see them from here, but all the container ships out there. So if you're wondering where your shit is, that's where it is. It's sitting on the water. Nice couple BMWs. And uh, I want to say that's my friend Anna's GT4 for Valley Motorsports. She she is a one of a hell of a professional race car driver. You should definitely check out her uh, her channel. Very nice Aston Martin. Couple of Z's and a G35. I mean, there's a lot of cool stuff in the parking lot. We haven't even gotten to the main lot yet. But yeah, I can't believe there's so many container ships sitting out on the water. There's at least 15 from the harbor where you can see them. It's absolutely insane. And my assumptions were right. Look at that. R33 GTR Skyline. Oh, it's a V-Spec too. Very nice. Look at that. It is indeed. Oh, focus. It is indeed a V-Spec. Very sick. Another dream car of mine that I really want. So we got a lot of supercars already up and down the aisles over here. Let's uh, cross over. And I mean, as you can already see, it's pretty packed. Here we are, right into the action. There's already an SV over there. Bunch of cars. Wow. First time here at Cars and Copters and I'm already blown away. And this isn't even the full... This isn't even all the cars that are supposed to be here today. There's supposed to be a hell of a lot more. Look at that. They got helicopters in the parking lot. Let's do that to find focus. There we go. 675 or 765 LT, an STO, another STO. Bunch of stuff. New GT500. Ooh, GT3 RS. Very sick. FH Rebuto. Got to get the last minute wax on the tires, make it look nice and shiny. Bunch of cool stuff out here, 308. Oh, look at the RX-7. My brother would fucking dig this. Unfortunately, my brother's not able to be here with me for these car shows anymore because he is officially a United States Marine. He graduated a month and a half ago from the Marine Corps Depot uh, San Diego. So I'm very proud of him. He's always wanted to do it. So anytime we come to shows, I always try to get the cars that he would like the best. And this RX-7 does not disappoint. 
I mean, just look at it. Very sick. Very sick. Now we got 720S with a full kit on it. Fucking sick. Performante with forged carbon. Very nice. Look at all the forged carbon on this. Very nice. This is cool too. Got a little dog. Look at that. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> Alright, now we're coming into the hypercar section of the event. Huntington Beach Police Helicopter. Very cool. 458 rolling in. Right over there. We got... Alright, we got Dan Speed Pro. We got a Blue Senna. SVJ. Magani Huara. I want to say this is Speedy Jeff's helicopter. We got Vader here. Speedy Jeff's Aguera RS. And we got the Apollo IE. Dan's Centenario. A P1. Just a bunch of other cars in here. Very cool stuff. We even, I don't think it's this one. I think it's a different one. Yeah, the one furthest down there that has the diamond, diamond encrusted paint. And look at this. Just hypercar after hypercar after hypercar after hypercar. Everywhere. Yeah, so you can see the sun on this one. If it picks it up on camera. See, see the diamond dust in it? So this is Dan's Regera. I mean, just the amount of cars that are here are unbelievable. Oh, there we go. Very nice. CCX. Very cool. There's the side. Here's then there's a P1 GTR. A lot of cars still showing up. There's a P1 GTR here. Okay. And then now I have two more Koenigseggs way down here that were at um, South OC Cars and Coffee and there was just little kids coloring all over them. Imagine being a, fit, a 10 year old kid painting on a $3 million car. I mean, they got a P1 on HRE. Very nice. I mean, there's just so much here. Silver. Wow. This this is sick. Look at that. Ferrari Enzo. And then you got a yellow Centenario over there. There's just too much here to see, and it's not even 10 o'clock yet. Now this this caught my eye. Look at the color on this Mercia Lago. Okay. Alright. Definitely got to get some photos of this car. Here's the R8 we've seen from a car show a while back. I mean, there's a bunch of stuff, and the lot's not even full cool yet. Mind you, the show starts at 10, so there's still people showing up. Treat rolling in on the flatbeds. We got the Trigolores, the Cinque, the Coops, and the Roasters coming in on flatbed trailers. This is, and look at everybody running. So, this is the only time I'm probably ever going to see these cars in person before Dan puts them back in hiding. Because he rarely ever takes these things down. Very cool. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Fire <laughs> BC. Uh, and then you got the Mercia Lago LP640 Roadster in blue. Oh. oh yeah, that's cool, but who gives a shit? The Mercy is where it's at. Sorry. Oh, oh white at 40 oh. yeah. It's all the way up there? It's all about the Mercy. Well, we were busy fucking chasing down the Zonda. I think Alex got the right idea, dude. Gee, look at, look at all this. Yeah, you got the right idea. <laughs> Enough fantasizing about the Mercy Lagos that are coming in. Another all forged carbon Huracan. Very cool. 
I mean, anything you name is here. It's just an absolute, oh look at Liberty Walk, Huracan parking up next to the Murcielago. They just got, they got a CGT here, Ferrari Enzo, Centenario, they have an SV, they're, and this is this is at the HRE station, but I mean this is something to behold. Look at that. You got a P1 there. So we're going back. Ah, oh, there's another Mercy. Another Mercy Lago. Oh, that's the one that passed me coming down here. Okay. Very nice. So hopefully we'll get some photos of that too. P1 and BBS wheels. Look at all the cars just rolling in. Oh, there's a La Perta. Jeez, there's Ronnie and his F430 Pista. Oh yeah, it's gonna be an insane day. There's the P1 GTR right there. Very nice red chrome wrap. And there are the Zondas right in front of us. Oh my lord. Oh, there's that one hurt, huh? Right there. <laughs> this is insane! So now we got the... the Gandhi Zondos on the flatbed trailers right over here. I'm gonna, I think they're either going to unload them or might keep them on the trailers. I don't know. But, uh, hey, you, you, a, you actually paid for your friends. Oh, fuck, I didn't see it. TDF with yellow stripes, a Liberty Walk Aventador, Huracan, Pista, and a bunch of other cars. Ah, oh, another Mercy. Just look at, just look at all the cars. All right. we've seen up at uh what was it what is going on over there two pagani pyros we've seen this one up at car week on pagani island still so cool to see dream spec dream spec right here <laughs> mercy me there you go Got another speed tail. I don't think this one's Dan's. Huh. Oh, it might be uh Oh it is. It's uh what's his name? It's his Hermes edition speed tail. All the Hermes edition, interior, everything. Very cool. Whole line of people here watching all the cars roll in and roll through. Another Mercy Lago, right there. And we got another Koenigsegg behind him. See if we can get a little, a little closer to that Mercy. 
When I tell you the Murcielago is my absolute favorite car, that is what I mean. It is absolutely my favorite car. Get a good views of all the cars coming in right now. Oh, the Mercy Lago is perfect. So if they don't want to pay. Just look at it. I know I talk about Mercy Lagos a lot, but look at it. It's just the road presence is fucking unbelievable. Oh, I want one so bad. And it's the exact spec and addition I want too. First gen is I think 2003 to 2008. Oh. That's incredible. We can get a little bit closer. There's Dan, a couple other cars coming in, but I just want to keep taking a look at this Mercia Lago right here. Oh, it just looks so good. Wow. Look at the orange glimmer in the sunlight. See, this is what I'm working for. I'm working hard to get one of these two people. Absolute dream fun. I wonder what JP Logistics has in the trailer. It's something cool. But dude, I want this so bad. You have no idea. I'm just like shaking over here just of how <laughs> it's awesome. This is exactly what I want too. This spec and this color and the generation of it. And then you got Coco Culture here in his Lamborghini Sion. Very cool. Great to see his car again. Out in the bow. This is the last time I seen him in Beverly Hills when he was chilling with Dan. Just eating at El Pastillo. And there's a kind of Dick Thor way up there. And just the road presence of these cars is something else. I mean, they, they, I mean, look at that. Beautiful. LP 640 in blue. Very nice. This is where most of the Lamborghinis are parked. A couple of McLaren's, Audis, Ferraris are lined up on that side. So we heard skid marks and uh, someone almost crashed. We got another La Faperta in like that cream white color. There was a know about that color, it's weird. Like, is it compared to the Pisca? Yeah. I don't know. Cool though. Mercy, Mercy still for me, but regardless. We're touring around and we finally got the Choir right here coming straight towards us. There's a Tesla Model Y in front of us. There we go. Very nice. All black carbon. Very sick. We're over here spotting and we got a dog in a backpack. There we go. Boom. Dog on a backpack. Perfect. So they finally parked that bottle. Dance Pagani. You could also sneak around. Another Pagani here. It's not even 10 o'clock yet. And they're already starting to fuck around out here. Look at any. Ah, oh, goddamn. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that made my day. Yeah, but it's this one. I feel so sorry for that. started not even a minute ago, like five minutes ago. Oh, there's Dylan. There's Daniel right there in the pink Tesla. Dude, traffic is so bad. It's only been ten minutes of the actual show. We're just waiting for this one guy to fucking send it. Oh, Cobra. Hell yeah. Way better. Shout out. We got Gigi's car over here. Car 720. There you go. 
So we're here trying to get photos of both of the Pagani's here. And as you can see, it's just a sea. There's a lot of more Pagani's down there by the helicopter. Yep. Yep. It's absolute chaos trying to, oh, there we go. We got a decent shot of it right here. <laughs> Drake over here is trying to get some photos. You can see down there of this, and it ain't happening. I mean, as, as long as I might be filming and I can kind of just stand way over here and make people go around, you might be able to get some shots. Honestly, but honestly, it might work. We got Dan's chips and over here, carbon over blue. No, I'm fine. I'm here looking at these all day. Hopefully later on in the day when the event starts to cool down and people start leaving, we'll be able to get some shots of these cars. But for right now, I mean, it's just absolute chaos. Got the green one right here. Yeah, shoot me a message and uh, maybe we can maybe share something out of it. <laughs> and now right over here we got the Apollo IE. Look at the exhaust tips on this car. I mean, that's just absolutely crazy looking. It looks like the screen, in a sense. Full matte carbon over gloss carbon right here. It's a polarizing action. So this is basically a road, semi-road legal race car, in a sense. These were designed specifically to be driven on the track, not on the streets. But, he was able to do it. Look at the interior. Red interior, as you can see it. There we go. Absolutely sick. And I didn't see this when this came in, but we got another Murcielago. Black over the orange, right here. The doors up and everything. This is like something out of Midnight Club LA. Full engine mm. It would be nice if it was all black, but not a fan of the orange accents on it. But that's just me. Comment below what do you guys think of it. show still got a couple more hours to go before it ends. Uh, it's not really anything new that showed up. I'll try and get up there. But yeah, a lot of cool stuff. car spotting in the parking lot. We got this little Jeep going off-road right here. <laughs> it's a little off-roading action going on. That's sick. Oh, let's see. Oh, there we go. Look at that. <laughs> oh, shit. It's fast, too. <laughs> oh, there you go. That's pretty sick. So there we got this. Right there. Phone charging. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> Just imagine a four hundred thousand dollar phone charger for your car, right on the hood.
go. I want to blow up again. Right. What? You scared? There you go. He's back with the snakes. <laughs> they just ball pipe. There you go. Ball pipe on, do more ball. I'm telling you, man, I'm a sucker for Mercy Loggers. I'm a sucker for these. It's just amazing. Little tan. I bet the reaction going on right here. People are already starting to be super stuck. <laughs> Some of the cars are starting to leave now and we got a red 992 leaving there was a blue one earlier she owns this car and the green one right here your pictures are amazing obviously super cool unfortunately it's getting close to three o'clock oh not really two it's 2 15 right now but people are starting to leave um all right the gt okay it actually sounds a little quieter than i thought the Turbo S obviously sounds super quiet, you can't hear it at all, but yeah, oh, GTR actually right there, there you go, alright, alright, fucking sick, alright, here we go, got a little SLR action, oh, there goes the AMG Black Series, got an SLR right here, very nice, what the hell, and an S2K, Oh, look at that, S2K AP2. Very nice. Very sick. Four, five, eight, and Tiffany blue. All right. Not bad, not bad. It flows so well with the car. But yeah, everybody's starting to take off. It's getting close to three right now. Um, the show is starting to wrap up slowly but surely. People are doing polls out on the street. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to record that because I got a special invitation to go do some rollers with some of the hypercars back there. So we're going to be doing that. But yeah, that's about it. This is the end of uh, Cars and Copters. Nothing really else left here. Um, a couple hypercars still left. You know, all the eggs. Uh, we we followed Dan and a bunch of the other guys down to the cave to get some rolling shots. Cool little SV. Fire BC still here. Chinque or the Chigawari? No, Chinque. P1 started up. Very nice. It was so cool to see these finally in person and I got to take some awesome shots of them. But I mean, just 
it in the sunlight is something else. Now it's starting to move. McLaren P1. Pretty short as of right now because they're going to be starting the silver helicopter right here. So we got to move all the cars out of the way so that way he's able to clearly take off. an intimidating mask. So we're going to film most of the helicopters taking off. So this one's going next. So we'll stop like right here.
dude had a fucking toucan in his car. Just, Okay, honestly, You're my witness, right? You've seen the toucan in the driver's seat, right? No. You didn't? Awesome. I caught that last fucking yes, minute. Oh, dude. <laughs> yeah, do a burn out of the tree. I will say. Alright. Oh, yeah. Well, we have officially reached the end of the show. I mean... I mean, like, like, I mean, finally seeing these in person is just incredible. So we're finally going to actually say goodbye and we're going to wrap up everything. And we're going to head on home for once. We've been here since 8 o'clock this morning. What a hell of a day it has been. So I hope you enjoyed the video today. Maybe I might make it into two parts. Who knows? We'll see. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked it, like the video. If you enjoy my videos, subscribe. You never know. Can you? Okay, Drake. I'll remember that. I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna keep that in the video too. To make. See, okay. See, see this man right here? What an asshole. What? <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. It was a very long one. Like he said, tomato. I'm fucking sunburned. I don't believe in sunscreen. But hope you enjoyed the video. See you in the next one.